Hello, this is Lord Og. Yes, it is, and welcome back to some more Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. Now, in the last episode, we saw some of this. 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 And a little bit of this. And now we're hoping to see a lot more, so let's get into the next episode. Let's go. Okay, let's see what we can do in this episode. See how many more we can kill. Okay, so let's go around here first. Oh, shiny. Let's grab the shiny. <laughs> grab the shiny. Right, um, fistful of ash. Oh, I can see. So it's basically you throw it in the face and it'll distract them for a second. And you could probably get a free, a free slashing or something and then that'll be it. Okay, let's check the door. Just to see if we can uh, get in. Doesn't open from this side. Okay, fair enough. Then we do have to go around this way. Let's go. Okay, so... Missing wall to the left there. Looks like we can grab that, air, that ledge across from the tree. Let's check down here. Don't think that's where we want to go. Anywhere where there's like a scuffed mark, a white scuffed mark on a ledge, it means you can hang or grab that ledge. No, that's too high. We're gonna have to definitely have to go from the tree. Okay. Let's do a jump. We'll try and catch that ledge. Definitely can't get <laughs> definitely can't get up there. So and go. Nope. Balls. Try again. Okay, and um, game out of position. Jump, grab. Right, we got it. Yeah, so just look for the scuff signs on the scuff marks on the ledges, and you'll you can see where you should go, or where you can hang on, I should say. Okay, so it looks like uh, there's a wall we can climb there because some scuffing on, but I think we'll come back later. I want to have a, I want to have a look down here first. Hug, hug the wall. You know, I don't really need my sword out. I don't know why I've still got my sword out. Because I don't actually need it out just to run round. Okay. Is that the door down there? Let's look around. We're going to have to get closer and have a look. Ooh, shiny. Shiny. I need to get to that shiny over there. But we'll get to that door first and check it out. Yep. Yeah, that looks like the door we've got to go to. Okay, we'll go back. Obviously, we've got things to do before before we do that. Shiny. I'm having that shiny. Come here, shiny. Okay, so back this way. I guess we have to climb that bridge now. Can I go up here from this? Can I get no. Wait, there's no scuff marks this side. That probably means that I can't. That I've got to come from the other side then. So, oh, balls. Of Slip. Okay, it's just no. Of course I can't because I can't. Ah, uh, because it's like a rocks. Oh, balls! I've gone right down now. I just keep, I just keep making it worse. It's a good job I can't go any further down, or I would be. Okay, let's go. Well, what's that? Enemy? Oh, lizard! Oh, death lizard! Totally killed Death Lizard. Number two. <laughs> Death Lizard. Dead. Okay, so we've got to kill something at least. Because this looks like it's just a lot of jumping and moving about, so I don't think we're going to get to kill much. Okay, so this way. We need to get back to that bridge and uh, go from there. And here we are. So you can see the scuff marks running up the walls, if to say. You know, you've got to run up here. And, and on the other side, there ain't none. It's just pure dark. So you obviously can't. Can't go up that side. So you have to go up here. Wall run. And then catch the wall there. You can see it scuffing on edge. There you go. Okay, so... 
Oh, two guards on bridge. Don't think we really need to touch them, though. All I need to do is make sure they don't see me. Okay, let's climb up here. What the bloody hell's that? Oh! It's a little ninja guy! We're a little... We're, we're a dagger! Little ninja assassin with big hat! Oh! You little guy! Okay, we should be close that shiny. Shiny! You little guy there. <laughs> uh, just resting. Well, not really. He's dead. Because I killed him nastily. But still, he were an assassin with the look of him, so he had to learn. Give me the shiny. Better be something good after we've come all this way. What is it? Bloody hell, it's more than pellets. Okay. Well, all there is left now, I've been round all this area. There's only the two guys on the bridge. I don't think I've got to go up there and kill them. I don't need to. So, I think it might best just for, go for the door. Okay, so, yeah, let's jump, jump down for the door and go, go there. There it is. There's not much else to do. This was quite a quick area. So let's call the little guy. How's he going to get here? Climbing all the bridge and that kind of thing. Shimming across the bridge. Oh, he's made it. Damn, is he a ninja too? I mean, Shinobi. Damn. Young boy. Did it or did all that? Thought I was clever. You found it. I did. Now let us leave this place. Yes, my lord. I agree. Yeah, he did well, didn't he? Because he, he meant he had to climb that bridge, shimmy along, climb up. That this is the only way. Go past the dead guy. The is the only answer. I see. Okay. Where oh no, he didn't. We go once we're away from the castle? He didn't have to shimmy across the bridge, did he? He just went another way. the Ashina border. Or perhaps we should hide somewhere. What do you think? Whatever you desire. Whatever I desire? That's the wolf I know. My lord. <laughs> oh, nothing. I was just reminiscing. Onward, then. Well, this kid talks like he's 60. He's about four. You know, he's about four years old and he talks like he's known me, like he's known me, like we've been buddies for years. Yeah, come to think of it, he wouldn't have to shimmy across the bridge. He could just drop down where that bridge part is and then run along and that's how he come down that way. Yeah, okay. Okay, big field with a scarecrow at the top and a... Nice rock in a tree there. Is that a scarecrow? Oh. Okay, I don't want to be that guy, but these reeds aren't moving as I'm move, running through them. It's just a little thing, it's no big deal. It's not like it's a game breaker, but, you know, it's like I'm a ghost, I'm just passing through them and they're not moving. Okay, we'll go to the scene. Divine air. Oh, you're into Scarecrow. Last we stood together was your uncle's funeral. Hi. Lord Genichiro. Ah, Genichiro, good. Good, we need him. I... Oh, no, no, we don't. No, we don't. He's a bad guy. Thank you. For what? Leave this to me. Oh dear, so he's behind all this. This kidnapping of the boy and that. So the noble shinobi stands in our way. Well, we're going to have a big try, but what the hell's that on your back? Why have you got a 12 foot bow? Do you really think you can pull that? That's just for show, come on. What are you trying to do? Compensate for littler things. <laughs> Got him. You face. Okay, it's cool. Ichiro Ashina. Well, that was a good introduction, but it didn't bother me. Oh, bitch! What was that? Kicking in the face. Yes. No. Thank you. What the hell was that too? He has some f fist full of ash. What the bloody hell is that? Oh no. Keep doing these weird symbols to me, you know. Oh, it's not flying. 
Oh shit, that hurt. This ain't good. This is good. Oh, I have some more fists full of ash. Oh, he's got me again. Bollocks. Oh, oh, okay. It's up the arm. It's a good job I don't masturbate with that arm. It's okay. Problem averted. I can still masturbate, it's fine. Right handed. Look at that stupid bow. You and your stupid bow. You need about seven men to pull that bow. Has to offer. Means all that I have done. The that. divine heir will be coming with me. Obviously, you meant to lose. Obviously, because otherwise, stupid big bow guy, it wouldn't have been a cutscene. You'd have to try again. But you still look like a girl with your stupid big bow, and I don't mean a bow in your hair. Got him. <laughs> I don't know. Oh dear. Well, I'm I'm screwed. That's not good. Poo. Okay, there's a light. Oh! Hairy leg guy! Damn, okay. I know he is. Wait, he's put a reed mat over me. What am I? Am I, am I like his new floor mat? He wanted a custom floor mat. I have a ninja that I've thrown a mat over. Come walk on him. Yes. You're not having me as your mat anymore. Hairy leg guy. Find someone else. That's why I'm aching, because there are all his friends that were walking over me. Oh. Ooh. What is this? Wooden hand. Well, it's a fake hand, of course. It's like a prosthetic. You know? Fake arm thing. Because you got yawn cut off. So you're awake. Oh, well, that's why I spoke, yes. And you've got hairy Looks legs. like death is not your fate. I'd agree. Not Yet. Okay, so we're gonna have some talking to do. She know we prosthetic. I said that the official arm we passed down sculpture. A replica of a human arm fitted with a variety of mechanisms apparently designed with modification in mind. While it bears a number of coats, it is stained thick with blood and oil. It has been impeccably maintained. So it's uh, you can add things to it. That's interesting. What do you call yourself? Uh, Fred? Your eyes. The eyes of a wolf who has failed in his duties. Or so it That's what I call myself. Wolf who failed in his duties. Your concern. <laughs> Spoken like a true shinobi, I must carve the Buddha. Okay. You what you will. You carve your Buddha, pal. It's a really nice Buddha. Very impressive. You, you go there. Oh, here. All I did was drag you here. Didn't even know if I was dragging a corpse. You just Couldn't wanted a let man. You get eaten by a pack of wild dogs. How long was I asleep? <laughs> Some time has passed since I found you. I see. However, your master yet lives. <laughs> He's being held prisoner in Ashina Castle. They will soon make use of his bloodline. Looking at you, I'm sure you appreciate the value it has. I have no idea what his value is. Well, I'll not. My left arm. What did you do to me? That is what I call the shinobi prosthetic. Oh, okay. A fitting fang for a one-armed wolf. Useless when it comes to carving blue. Yeah, I can see that, pal. You can have it. Shinobi prosthetic. It is no mere replacement for your lost arm. It's not easy to Talk carve a body with a prosthetic, I'm guessing. Shinobi tools. I will. Shinobi tools. Why do you keep repeating everything he says? For this device. <laughs> you catch on quick. If you bring me shinobi tools, I'll find a way to fit them to the shinobi okay, prosthetic. Okay, got you. Then you'll come to appreciate its worth. <laughs> I've said too much. Go now. Where? What did you mean when you said they'll make use of his bloodline? I don't know much about him, except the dragon's heritage. There's a special kind of blood by that name. And that blood runs through your master's veins. So the divine heir. Someone's after him. 
Might be that the strange things happening to your body have something to do with that. Okay. You're quite the strange one. Yet other peculiar visitors have come to this temple. There's one in the clearing to the right of the gate leading off the temple grounds. I'll go see strangers in strange circumstances. You two might get along. Okay. Well, I guess that's it then. We've, uh... You see the kind-faced Buddha there? It is a kind-faced Buddha. isn't one of mine. It was carved by the true sculptor. Oh, and so you're a fake sculptor. what is inside of him. Okay. It can probably be of help. Confront what is inside him. Well, you're repeating Anger, him again. Sadness. Or perhaps old memories of times long gone. That kind of thing. That kind of thing. Okay, so we'll start again from there. And because this is a new place, so it's a good place to start new for the third episode. So uh, thanks for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, remember to click that like and I'll do the next episode hopefully tomorrow. So you take care and goodbye for now.